Hey, we're going to look at a problem with a Crown Vic 2003 police interceptor. Axle problem or bearing problems? We're going to find out which. Well, here's the bearings. You can see that there's oil on them. It's on my finger. And they spin. There's no damage to them. And this drive shaft is straight, it's not crooked or bent, wasn't damaged in anything. There's the diff, still good gears, everything's nice, I've partly disassembled it. There's this part of the spiders. Here's the other side, same kind of bearings. Okay, here's a hardness test. This one's an original one. It puts some little tiny scratches on this one. This one here is put in by Fearless Gear, uh, Fresno or Clovis, and the same stroke. There's a there's already a thousandth groove in there. That was where the bearings ran. This is where the bearings ran on this one. This one's this is a real piece of junk. It's the only thing I can say about it. it. Doesn't say it's made in China anywhere, but the metal's not hard enough. The bearings are okay. They put a groove in there. The bearings did that. And here's the bearings. They're down here. I showed them to you already. And they spin real nice. They're not even marked. There's a lot of metal flour in here. But these bearings, there's no problem with these bearings. Except I've been pounding on them. I might have ruined them trying to get them out. i got to get a uh, bearing puller. I'm going to do that uh, on Monday. Okay, these are the guys that installed this part about two years ago. There's about 12,000 miles on it. Uh, they do good work. But man, they sure used a piece. But if you use a bad part, the work's no good. Yeah, that's the original one. They're going to have to do something to make this right, or this video is going to stay on here for the rest of my life and their life. This is the one that has the soft metal shaft. There's about a 15,000 groove that the bearings caused. Those are the bearings again. Bearings are not damaged. The bearings did not freeze. And they're USA made. This is a differential. Fearless Gear told me, hey, there's probably a bend in this outer housing, probably a couple of thousands. Well, that's BS. There's no dents on that housing anywhere. The police didn't run over anything with it. As far as I can tell, it's straight. Well, in conclusion, I'm going to have to say that uh, all the problem that this car had is with that axle shaft. And I wouldn't have had this problem if Fearless Gear hadn't used a cheap aftermarket part. So let's see what happens. I'm going to talk to them on uh, Monday. I'm going to let them know I got this video up. And we'll go from there. Thank you very much and take care.